After reading this, you've discovered the ruins of an ancient Roman city. Its existence is long forgotten, all knowledge of it lost, except in the Latin inscription here. It reads, Mortal, step forth. Those who seek peace will find paradise in the depths of the earth. Those who seek gold will find riches beyond imagining, but will pay for this folly with their lives. Be warned, there is no return to the land of the living. Could an entire underground city have remained undiscovered after all this time? Could people have survived down there against the odds? It seems there's only one way to find out. If I'm not back in an hour, I'm somewhere on the other side. Consider this an invitation. Or a warning. Alworth, January 1st. To whoever reads this, I'm so sorry you had to find me like this. And worse that you'll suffer the same fate I did. I've spent a lifetime in this place, going around and around in circles, searching for a way out. But the inscription was right. There is no way back. In here, there are only two options. Death. Or that godforsaken window of the past. I made the mistake of opening that door. I wanted to set things right. And I tried. I really tried. But whatever I did, it took me right back to the beginning. Don't make the same mistake. Better to end it all now. And find out what awaits you beyond that door. Down on your right is our farm, where I grow all the food you'll ever want. As long as all you want is leek, cabbage, and potatoes. <laughs> ah, that one usually gets a chuckle. The bloodless shadows wander without flesh or bone. Don't mind her. She means well. She's just been in a bad place since... Well, you know, I don't know what happened to her. Up here on your right is the chasm. If you've got a weapon, it belongs way down at the bottom. Most of us have almost nothing. Just what we had on us when we arrived, and what we've been able to make and scrounge up since. Up on your left is the forum, where you can visit the market, or get yourself patched up in Lucrezia's clinic in the Shrine of Apollo. And this central plateau is where the Magistrate and the other patricians live. So don't expect a warm welcome. We're finally alone. I assume you already know who I am. May I know your name? A curious name, to match a curious accent. But I digress. Now, you're probably wondering why I summoned you, and I'll get to that. But first, take a look at this wondrous place, would you? A secret city built deep in the mountains many hundreds of years ago. Indeed. More importantly, consider the miraculous community we've built here over the last nine months. Twenty-two complete strangers brought together by the fates, living and working together in our own little paradise. And in all that time, not a single sin has been committed. No fights, no theft, nothing. Have you ever witnessed something so extraordinary as a city without sin? Nor could I until I came here. But the reason for this, this miracle, is as simple as it is terrifying. If even one person commits a sin here, every last one of us will die. Ah, good. So, are you with me? Can I count on you to figure out who's about to break the golden rule? Wonderful. Now, 
I need you to investigate the city, talk to everyone, help them, if it'll win their trust. I authorize you to enter private homes and inspect possessions and documents if necessary. Figure out who the culprit is, and as soon as you have a name, come back and tell me immediately. I'll be up here, standing watch. Thank you, and good luck. Our lives are in your hands. shall suffer for the sins of the one.